Hi guys, hope you're all okay. It's Chantel, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a review of a new release. It's a fragrance by Roberto Cavalli and it's called Paradise Found. Now I hadn't heard much about this fragrance at all, but I think it was released at the very end of last year and i haven't really heard many people talk about it so i was really intrigued of what it would smell like because i loved the advertisement behind it it looked like a really tropical fragrance and when i looked it up it was like a lady like in a rainforest which really made me want to buy this fragrance. There's also a version for men as well. And when I've looked up the notes on that one, I really like the sound of that as well. So I might purchase that and do a review on that one. Because as I say, I've looked up on YouTube and not many people have reviewed these fragrances. So anyway, this is the box the fragrance comes in. And I really love the box. I think it does give like that rainforest vibe. It's this beautiful like sort of burgundy colour. And it's got like your palm leaves on here and then like your gold writing. I think the box is really beautiful. And I love, love, love the bottle. I think this is stunning. I love the shade of it. I think it looks beautiful. It looks like a gemstone. And then it's got like a gold hardware and there's like a snake around the bottle there. The lid is just like a plastic lid. But I really like the overall look of the bottle. So this fragrance is definitely an oriental floral. I'll go through the notes with you. The top notes are pink pepper, neroli and palm leaf. The mid is jasmine, orange blossom and frangipani. And the base is sandalwood, heliotrope and patchouli the main notes i get from this one is the patchouli really does stand out if you don't like patchouli fragrances i don't think you would like this one you also get quite a bit of the palm leaf which i think is quite rare in fragrances and the palm leaf really gives it like that greenness which i really love in this fragrance you also get a little bit of the jasmine and orange blossom and the sandalwood definitely comes through in the dry down. It becomes like quite a musky fragrance, which I've really been enjoying. I've tested this out over the week and I've been loving this fragrance. I think it's really beautiful. It's quite unique and it does give off that sort of amazon vibe i can really imagine a stunning lady in the amazon but it reminds us of like a rainforest at night it's got like a deepness a mysteriousness about it it's not like a typical tropical summertime fragrance it's definitely more of a deeper i'd say nighttime fragrance although i would definitely wear this through the day as well i still think this one's quite mass appealing i think quite a lot of people would like this one but it's just i think a really beautiful summertime fragrance i can see myself wearing this a lot you get quite a lot of summertime fragrances that are quite light and airy and flirty where this one to me is more like a deep sexy seductive summertime fragrance and i really really love it if i had to liken it to any fragrance i'd say it doesn't smell anything like this fragrance but it gives off the same sort of vibe is Mugler's Aura. It's got that sort of uniqueness and it just really reminds us of that fragrance in a way but it's not because the smell the same it just has a similar sort of vibe. I think if you love Mugler's Aura 
you'd really like this one because it just gives off that same sort of greeny sexy summertime vibe if you get what i mean but yeah i think this has been a really great release for roberto cavalli and i can really say that a lot of people would love this one i'd say that this one lasts around four to five hours on the skin if you're spraying it on clothes i would say that would last quite a bit longer i'm quite a heavy sprayer so i've been spraying this quite a lot and i did get i'd say a good five hours from it and it projects quite nicely my husband really liked this one when i tried it so yeah i think it's a really great fragrance and i got this for a great price actually i got it on natino and i think i just paid over 30 pounds for it and this is the 75 mil so that was a great deal so yeah i'm really really happy with this one i'd love to know if any of you have tried it and i'm really interested to see what you think of it if you have tried it leave us a comment and let us know or if you want to try it as always i love chatting with you all so let us know what other roberto cavalli fragrances i should check out because as i say i've tried none of the others so i was quite open-minded with this one and i've been pleasantly surprised i'm really really enjoying this fragrance so as always guys thank you so much for watching give us a big thumbs up if you liked the video subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so and press the notification bell and i'll see you all very very soon on the next one bye